Okay, today I'm going to show you how to put your PS3 into DMZ mode, which means that um, you can have open NAT type in Modern Warfare 2 and other games. To do that, you need to make sure that you have NAT type, or I mean um, DMZ uh, feature in your router. So if you don't have DMZ feature in your router, then uh, I don't think you can put your PS3 into DMZ mode. So if you want to find that out, go to um, Google. I mean not Google your internet browser and type in the address bar 192.168.0.1 and press enter you will get this um, rec the uh, password username and password thing you just need to put your username and password like uh, if you can if you don't know what it is you can find it on the side of your router or like in the back of the router Yes, so you have then login. Okay, so once you log in, you need to go. This is like the the top of it. So you need to go to applications and gaming. Once you go there, um, you need to find DMZ right here. If you can't find it, then you can like go to Google and type in your router model or name and um find out where to find DMZ if you don't have DMZ in your router you, I don't, you don't you can't do this so don't follow the other steps so if you just click on the DMZ and make sure you have DMZ here this is the DMZ now once you may have made sure that you have DMZ in your router you can do the next step okay so now that you know that you, um, you have DMZ feature in your um, router you can go ahead and click on start type in CMD and hit enter. You'll get um this and here just type in IP config and you'll get all these um information. What you need to do is just got uh, write down the um, IP gate a default gateway of your router, which is um right here on the top you just click this arrow you'll get the, you'll get it right there see it's there default gateway right here default gateway 192.168 and all that just copy this down let's it on to the ps3 internet connection setting press ok and then you need to select custom go to wireless um, enter manual. This is this, this is important. It's supposed to be enter manual. Or you can scan it, but it's not. I don't think you can do that. So just go there. Right here. Uh, just type in your password if you have one like for your router. Okay. And this is here. Also custom. I uh, um, also choose um manual instead of automatic. And here. You'll we'll see IP address and default router novels. Okay, for the first one, type in 192.168.0.108 or like one. Or you can choose from like one from 100 to like 110. Okay, so for the subnet mask, there's gonna already it's gonna be 255.255.255.0. If you don't have it, just type it in. And for the default router and primary DNS and secondary DNS, just type in the IP address you wrote down earlier. Mine is that one, so yeah, I just put that one. Okay, once you do that, then press X. I mean, no, not sorry, we'll go, go to the next step. Right there. And here, just put like automatic the MTU settings. The proxy server you don't want to use proxy so just don't use it and um if you have UN UPnP on your router you can just enable it and here you can either if you want no not here you can test the connection if you don't you can just go back but I would suggest testing it Okay, so let's see. Even if you if it says fail, 
doesn't matter just go um, go to the computer and I'll show the next steps just turn off the PS3 you can just leave it on standby to do that on okay so now that you're on the PS uh, PC again you need to go to the internet browser again I have Google Chrome and I'll do the same like we did last time go to the um, internet I mean the uh, router go to your router so just type in 192.168.0.1 and press enter and here you'll get this um this code and you know what to do just log in and then once the, when you come here the top you have to click on applications and gaming again and then go to DMZ click on DMZ and type in the um, the, the last three uh, numbers you wrote, uh, I mean, you typed into the PS3, like I told you, from 100 to 100 to 110 or something like that. So I, I I put 108 here. So just do that and save settings. This this will um, restart your router, so don't worry about it. And once you do that, you can go back to the PS3 and log in. Here you can just like do it about. PlayStation Network and click on the sign in. Uh, I'm signed in so I don't have to do that. So just to prove it that it works, I to, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and play Modern Warfare to make sure that it's open. So start multiplayer. And there we go. It's an AT type open. So please rate and subscribe for